to the beautiful people of the world. It's your girl Aubrey and welcome to Curb Logic. If you've already noticed this shirt, I'm doing two videos in a day. Don't judge me. I'm doing hard work just for you guys because I love you. But if you are a faithful follower or a newcomer, hey, hey, y'all, what's up? Thanks for coming to my channel. You will not be disappointed. So with graduation and ceremonies coming around the corner, I thought, why not do a get ready with me? Today, I had the amazing opportunity to go to a senior recognition dinner. And I thought, my people want to come. We are celebrating life and acceptance and achieving the greatest accomplishment ever, graduating college, okay? Not kids, not marriage, college, because college is stressful. But y'all not ready for that conversation. So I was like, let's do a get ready with me. See, you know, catch up with my lovely people on the on the web. See what's going on, what they're up to. And let's get fleek while I'm at it. You know, let's slay the game while we're... It's called multitasking. So today I have the amazing opportunity to go to my group senior recognition dinner, which is a scholars program I was in since freshman year. They've helped me get through some amazing times and also difficult times. So, I'm, you know, I wanted to show my appearance, you know, meet my community, say hello, thank them again for everything they've gotten me through. And, you know, I want to get jazzed up. I want to look cute, you know, for the photo ops. And I wanted to take you with me. So are you ready to go? Let's get ready. So for me, the outfit truly begins when you decide what to wear. The makeup, the accessories can last after, but I'm struggling, y'all. I don't know if I should do black and sleek or pink and spring. You know, we're, spring is just around the corner. Actually, forget it. It's here. But summer's around the corner. So I want to know, should I step or should I, like, do seductress? What do you think? What do you think? 2,000 years late. So I've asked around. I made an Instagram poll. And guess what won? The black and sleek. So I'm going with this cute off the shoulder dress. You really can't see and I'm so sorry. But comes with cute little frilly dill. Uh, what is this called? I'm blanking. Sleeves. Ah, sleeves. <laughs> and it's just cute. It comes to the midriff. So not the midriff. LOL. Mid knee. And we're about to start. So let's get it started. So now's the fun. The makeup. But y'all don't get too ahead of yourselves thinking, oh, I'm about to be the next makeup artist, honey. I can barely keep it together for the natural look. So, but this is a work in journey. This is a work in progress. This is a journey. So I got to start ugly to get, you know, I got to start looking like a cloud in order to look like the next Beyonce's makeup artist. You know, I got to work. It's called growth. Growth. Okay. So let's start with a clean canvas. So I had to do a little bit of prepping off screen, y'all. So had to lay the edges and get the braids together because you have to have your braids fleeky at all times. And mine was looking a little hood red, you know, a little rough. But it's okay, they're back. So in order to fully start the transformation, I have to demask. I have a little bit of natural makeup on here. I'm gonna take that off right quick and show you how the rest goes. I'm using Ulta Beauty on the go cleaning makeup remover. I don't know if you can see it. There you go. I mean, it worked like six bucks at Ulta, but they do what I gotta do. They do what, they, what needs to be done. Heads up. The makeup you're about to see is full of hodgepodge. So I might have some beauty supply makeup, some CVS makeup, and some of the Ulta and Sephora. It all, you know, mixes together. They all do the stuff, but you know, it depends on how broke I am at that moment I go buy makeup. You know, I think it keeps you humble to have a various amount of different things. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm demasked. I kind of still look the same, but you're not going to do me like that, so whatever. <clears throat> then we're going to go with our Born This Way, Too Faced. There you go. Ooh, my nails need to be done, so I ain't going to show you like that. Ooh, go like this. And this is in the shade Caramel. 
what do y'all be saying? Caramel or caramel? I've heard a lot of different. I don't really know. Oh, see, that's how you know I'm, look. My brush done broke. But she just boop, popped that back in there. Good as new, okay? But yeah, caramel, caramel. I don't be knowing. I don't know, I don't know. But yeah, how was y'all's break? Like, it was holiday season for some of y'all. If y'all celebrate Easter, but if y'all don't, how was it? How was relaxing? How was your weekend? Wow, this looks a lot lighter than what it should. Maybe because I'm like in the sun. Oh, there you go. Let me fix this. The faux head. You gotta get the faux head. Wow, maybe this is what I'll be looking like in the sun if I don't correctly blend it. <laughs> I'm shook, y'all. This is real. This is real. Sometimes, you know, maybe I don't need foundation. Oh, there you go. Mm. You know, I'm just trying to be cute. This is why I say natural face, natural beat. You know, all this foundation, this cakey stuff. You cute the way you are. But hey, if you want to use it, hey, use it. But don't be like me. Get a summertime foundation. Because, as you can see, this is wintertime, Aubrey. And I'm... I broke it beyond repair. Y'all, oh my god, I am so cross. Oh, it's so cute. I have my window of my dorm outside. And I can see one of my co ras feeding the squirrels. She's so cute. Me? Could never, because, you know, I'm scared. But <sighs> one day I hope to be like that. Woo, my forehead. I feel like this is a, like... Try not to laugh video because it's just that bad, but I still look cute. So, oh, Too Faced blush, but this is the peach. This smells like peach too. But before we do that, I want to go in with some bronze booster. Don't know the actual name because it's from Walmart, but it does the job. You ever see those like beauty videos where they be like, oh, I use brush 455 of the MAC. I'm like, oh, funny. I don't know what brush this is. Got it for Christmas. Shout out to my sis. And been using them ever since. Now, y'all, this is going to sound trifling. But I just feel like y'all won't judge me. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't know you had to wash your brushes. Okay, it sounded way tr more trifling when I said it out loud. But, yeah, I didn't know you had to wash your brushes till like, six, seven months in. Of uh, doing makeup and um, even after didn't didn't even didn't even wash them. It took me a while, and I stumbled upon a YouTube video. It was like the dangers of not washing your brush, and I was like, oh shoot, let me get my life together right quick. And, and this is this is the moment you blend see that forehead forehead it's two different colors let's monochromatic honey make it ooh, make it one I has to look cute I'm making it nasty I'm glad you guys are doing well well I hope you guys are I always ask I always see youtubers <clears throat> ask these questions but then realize nobody can really answer the questions so it's just like an awkward pause I mean oh shoot this is how you know I'm not official. I forgot to put my primer on, elf. Not sponsored, but uh, oh, now my face really about to be crusty. Oh well, we're gonna pray on it and keep it going. My you know, eyebrows. Don't, don't get excited. I don't do all that concealer and stuff. Literally just do some gimme brow. Y'all, I was talking to my line sister the other day and she was like, Aubrey, how do you manage to put on makeup? And not look like you put on a lick. I was like, ooh. Were you reading me, sis? <sighs> but, you know, you're not wrong. Because it really don't look like I put any on. But, hey. I think the natural face is just phenomenal. Let me quit lying. Because if I really did learn how to put on makeup. Pfft, that couldn't tell me nothing. But my attention span is just. It's just not there right now. Like, boop, boop. Mascara. This is Lash Sensational. Okay, looks kind of look dirty, but hey, you know, it's hard out here for a pimp. So, 
Let's get it. I'll just do something on the floor, but it's okay. Oh, my lashes are kind of done from earlier. But yeah, I, I have been practicing learning to put on fake lashes. Oh, have I been successful? No. and eyes and all that good stuff are done I am going to dry my face and highlight and I'm serious so we're going to use the L'Oreal Los Angeles see what I tell you some stuff is expensive and some stuff isn't it's how it is so first I like to do you know a little nose bloop, bloop. you know my mom calls me Rudolph but the glitter reindeer and I'm like oh, thanks mom you know, I try my best to be the best that I can be. So, oh, and I, oh, look at that light. Look like a glitterified honey bun. Oh, I am hot, hot. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Nothing. Then. Honey bun status. Uh -huh. I look great. Honestly, truly. Wow. Hey. That's a bam. You didn't even, I'm gonna be in sunlight for you to see that. Ooh. Ooh. Chile. I am magnificent. So we're gonna finish with the Mac Prep and Prime. <laughs> even I forgot to prime. <laughs> and then we're gonna spray it. So I probably always spray too much, but so good. Then I always feel extra and go on with the fan, you know, make sure it's dry. And dang, girl, you are hot. Hot. My lip gloss is popping. My lip gloss is cool. All the boys be jogging. They chase me after school. Hey. So, ooh. So, you know. So, my beautiful divas, now is the fun part. Please, you know, disregard my bed. But now it is time to accessorize and decide what can make this regular black dress go into a masterpiece that will be slayed by me. Moi, of course. So, I picked three bags. So I'm thinking off the shoulder black dress with frilly sleeves seems very sophisticated. So I kind of wanted to go with a sophisticated purse. Now here we have, you really can't see, but it's like, more of a pink blush color purse that I got from ASOS. It's showing up tan, but I promise, guys, it's it's pink. And then we have a cute little crossbody from Michael Kors. Shout out to my uncle, you know, birthday present. And then here we have a Louis Vuitton tote bag. All three are gems that I carry almost all the time, but I just wanted to see which one do you think might truly spice up the fit and make it one of a kind. Now we're moving to the shoes. So here we have, you know, I'm not really one for heels. So, you know, I'm about to live my chunky heel life for the rest of my life. So I'm just so glad that they're in season, honestly. Here we have a cute snake skin black. I don't know if you can see it. Got these from Ashley Stewart. And then I have a nice soft mauve heel. I was thinking, oh, a touch of pink, um, followed by the mauve purse and the pink um, jewelry could really like make a statement in itself and create a color coordination that I was trying to look, but what do you guys think? Comment below if you think the pink would look better or should we stick to the all black? Now we have my fave, which is the jewelry. We have a cute long ended necklace that really comes down to like mid chest and it's pink. We have the brown that lays just about the same. And then we have a thing of pearls. Now, I love those. I love all three. And all three will look amazing with this dress. But I really want to bring in a statement. And I don't know what statement I'm trying to make. But I think the pearls will bring sophistication. The um, brow will be more, you know, 
business, professional, keep it all the colors the same. And I think the pink will be really spicy with a little bit of flair, you know. So I'm just trying to decide what, what fit am I going for today. So stay tuned. I hope you all enjoyed my Get Ready With Me Senior Recognition Dinner version. Um, This is my final product. I'll show you a little clip. You know, step it on next per usual. I hope you all enjoyed this fabulous video of me embarrassing myself while getting ready. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. List your favorite part of the video. You know, it was a hot mess at the beginning, but I always wrap it back around. Bring it back. Snatch it back. So stay tuned for more episodes. Love you more. Stay fabulous.